Alright guys, so today we are going to be playing Can a Cute Ghost Story Be Spooky? This is a game by Dima Studios. Hi kids, ready to be scared? I don't want to lie. It will be a very scary story. If you get scared easily, you are free to leave. Okay. Are you still here? So, do you want to hear the story? Of course. Okay. Don't complain with me if you cry. I warned you. I do cry. Well, in a dark cemetery full of scary ghosts, there's an old house haunted by a specter called Jimmy. Jimmy. Jimmy is only 374 years old. He's basically just a little kid like you. And in this house that our story begins. Like every night, Jimmy takes his favorite hat in front of the mirror before leaving the house. No one can understand how special that hat is to Jimmy. It was given to him by his mother for his 276th birthday. If only someone tried to steal it, <laughs> Jimmy would probably go crazy. This is a dark and spooky night, but Jimmy doesn't care. He is always happy. Usually Jimmy greets the family before going to the town. He is such a thoughtful guy. Penny, he was never good at playing guitar. Commemorative obelisk for the coolest dudes of the past. Mike. Anderson. He lived a quiet life until he was arrested by the police for fraudulent bankruptcy. We want to rest in peace. Private cemetery. Bob. He didn't believe in death. How Hello family, how are you today? Come on guys. Seems to be in a mortuary. Answer me please. Okay. I'll play some music. Death is too long to be bored. Oh, okay. I hope you like this music. It will last approximately 20 hours. Jimmy, stop this music now! Sorry, but this music cannot be stopped. Now I'm going to town. Bye. Jimmy, come here! You- Wow, that's why I love Jimmy. He is so innocent and naive. Luckily, I applied some family-friendly filters to this story. We certainly don't want to see Jimmy cry. Yeah. Bye, enjoy the music. After two hours, Jimmy has finally arrived. And now he's so hungry. Luckily, he knows an excellent Italian restaurant in town. It's a perfect night to eat pizza. Mmm, pizza. Ah, oh, f***, another balloon is popped. Hey dude, don't be mad. Do you want to get a pizza with me? I'll pay for it. Really? Thanks, buddy. Anyway, I'm Dave. It's nice to meet you. Nice to I'm meet you, I'm Jimmy. Dave. Nice to meet you, too. Follow me to the restaurant. Now Jimmy and his new friend are ready to have a good night of fun. Look, I have a friend. Hello, Dave. Balloons, just $3 each. That's a good deal. Oh. Oh. Hello. Jimmy, nice to see you again. Is the guy next to you your new friend? Yes. yes. His name is Dave. He likes to eat pizza like me. Well, Dave, you are in the right place. Oh, I make the best Italian pizzas in town. Now take a seat so I'll take your orders. Thanks. You seem like a very nice person, Mario. He does seem like a very nice person. Jimmy, aren't you forgetting something? Um, yeah, yeah. I have to wash my hands before eating. You know, hygiene first. Good boy, Jimmy. Good boy. Alright, I washed my hands. Okay, guys, which pizza do you want to order? Hmm. Good choice, Jimmy. And you, Dave, what do you want to order? 
I would like to taste the most traditional pizza in Italy, the pineapple pizza. Pineapple pizza is a traditional Italian pizza? <laughs> Jimmy, you didn't tell me your new friend was so funny. I'm not joking, I'm serious. Ah. Uh, Jimmy, how many times have I told you not to let these pizza criminals into my restaurant? <laughs> Sorry, Mario. I thought Dave was a normal ghost. Guess I was wrong. Now, can I have my pizza? Of course. You always remain my favorite little customer. One hour Mario's later. pizza is always good. Yes, it's true. But to be honest, Mario seems strange these nights. Why is he strange, narrator? Mario seems more angry lately. I think something is going on. Yeah, yeah. maybe you're right. But it doesn't really matter now. I want to go to sleep. I'm tired. Okay, we'll talk about it tomorrow. Alright, I'm going home. My hat! Oh no! <gasps> this hole stole my hat! Now the party's ruined. Oh, someone's knocking on the door. Well, maybe it's my friend Dave. Okay, oh, okay. this is. It's. It's. Jimmy! Jimmy! God. My balloons were stolen! I'm very worried! Be calm. In my party, there are many balloons. Follow me. Thanks, friend. I knew I could trust you. Yes, come with me. What happened here? The party's gone? I'm sorry, Dave. There are no more balloons now. Dave? Wh what? D Dave, wh where are you? Dave? Dave? We're missing Dave. <sighs> okay. What a strange dream. Luckily it's all fake. Right? Nobody oh, stole my- Oh, f No! Someone stole my favorite hat like in my dream. The thief must have made a hole in the wall to get into my house. Henrietta, are you there? Can you hear me? What should I do now? Narrator? Now this is weird. Last night he told me he had to tell me something important today. And now he's gone. Oh, it's Dave. Better open the door. Jimmy! Jimmy! My balloon- Yeah, I know. Your balloons have been stolen and you're very worried. What? How did you know that? Are you the thief? It's not me. I just had a premonitory dream. Tonight, even my favorite hat was stolen. Before knocking on your door, I saw someone enter the ancient abandoned crypt. Maybe it's the thief! Really? Let's go, friend. We must take back what is ours. Okay, so we have to... Jimmy, stop! I, I can't go with you. What's the problem, dude? Don't you want to get your balloons back? Yeah, I want them back. I'm just afraid of abandoned places. You will not be alone. You'll be with me. Here we go. I'm sorry, Jimmy, but I'm staying here. Ah, you're just a wimp. Mm -hmm. I don't need you. I'll go in there alone. It exploded. I don't need Dave. I can find my hat by myself. Don't need Dave. Do it without Dave. Mission. Don't need Dave. Strong, independent ghost. I'm a strong, independent ghost. Strong, independent. 
independent ghost. Don't need no Dave. Man, there's a lot of stairs in this script. Right, where are we going? Down. What is this place? I've never been here before. Oh, okay, not that way. Alright, so... We have three choices here. Uh, middle. No. Okay. Left. Yes. Alright, two choices. Middle. Yes. This way. No! I knew. It wouldn't be the most simple way. Left. This way. Street. Right. Left. Left. Perfect. Strong independent ghost. Ha! The thief. Now that he's not looking at me, I better find a weapon to hit him. Ooh, this piece of wood could come in handy. Oh, this hurts! Who are you? I'm Jimmy, and I'm here to get my hat back. You understand that, thief? I'm not a thief! Wait, what? So what are you doing here, then? I'm the famous Professor William. I'm from England, here to study these ancient inscriptions. What? They look like they're drawn by five-year-old kids. You're just a troglodyte. You don't understand the importance of history. It all began 15 centuries ago. Lord Frederick was governor and- uh, I don't have time for that now. I really have to find my hat. Okay, if it helps. I saw a dude with a chef's hat a while ago. He was holding a red hat in his hand. My yes. hat's red, and the dude over there with the chef's hat is Mario. So where did it go? I, I really need to know. He entered the door near me. Thanks, Professor. You're pretty helpful, actually. Uh, where do you think you're going? You have to do one thing. Did you think hitting me with a piece of wood had no consequences? Uh, okay, what, what, what do you want me to do? You have to bring me an ancient map. It's located in a very dangerous area of the crypt. Some say they have seen strange ghosts in this area. But don't worry, this is just a story made up to scare the kids. Moreover, it's very dark there. Luckily, I'm also an inventor. I created special glasses to see better in the dark. Do you want them? I'm glad someone tries my inventions. I'm sure these glasses will be very useful for you. Wow, these glasses are very useful. Oh god. They are very useful. Oh, what the heck is that? Oh god. Strange ghost. Low battery? What? What, on my glasses? Man, these glasses are useless. Battery ran out immediately. There is an arrow on the floor. Maybe if I follow it, I'll find something. What if I... What if I don't, though? The map! I better take it and get out of this dark place. I don't like that. This game is actually kind of spooky. Run, why? Why run? I ran the wrong. I ran the wrong way. Where? What if I don't? What if I don't? Oh. Okay. All right. Okay. I will run. I will do the running. Okay. I am. I am. Of the run. Oh God. Okay. I don't know what I'm supposed. 
supposed to do here? Run to where? Okay, okay, just kite them. Hurry. I can do that. Cool. Out. To the out now, please. Okay, where is he? Okay, hello. Hi. Whoa, I found the map. Excellent. Was it difficult to find? No. Nope. Not so much. Mostly, it was just very dark in that place. Luckily, you had my special glasses. Was it useful? Yeah, yeah. Your glasses are very uh, useful. Yes. Thank you. You're the first person who likes them. If you want, I have uh, other inventions for you to try. Uh, no thanks. Now I have to go. Okay, bye! Always be kind. My hat! Congratulations, Jimmy! Oh. You did it! Oh. What? Yeah, Jimmy, congratulations! Uh, can someone explain to me what's happening? We stole your hat just to create an adventure for you. We only did it because today is your birthday. Guys, my birthday's not today. Also, someone has to give me some money to repair that wall of my house. Oh, <laughs> Jimmy, look behind you. A flying unicorn! Where is it? Pew. Uh, guys? Where are you? Come back. Like, I really want that money. Well... This is the end of our story. I hope the story wasn't too scary for you. It was. Now Jimmy will have to pay for the damage with his own money. That's the scariest But in part. the end, he found his favorite hat. And this hat, it's me. Oh. Yeah, kids. I'm a talking hat and narrator of this story. Ha ha ha. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> that makes sense. It now makes sense why, when the hat was stolen, we couldn't hear the narrator. Game by Dima Studios. Game entirely created by Dima. YouTube Dima Studios. Voice actor, the narrator. Voice of Pecan. Jimmy, voice of Panda Bum. Jeff, the voice of Adrianic. Dave, the voice of King Wiz. Mario, the voice of Jared Duncan. Professor William, the voice of fellow player. Alright guys, well, thank you so much for watching this short, spooky, cute, cute game um, called Can a Cute Ghost Story Be Spooky? Um, I think it was a little jump scary. It was definitely cute and adorable. Um, I loved all the characters and that crazy plot twist at the end. If you guys liked this video, feel free, leave a like, a comment, and share this video. I hope you guys all have a great night and I'll see you guys all in the next video.